Hey guys, welcome to my channel Data Driven Decision. In this channel, I talk about the data science and machine learning kind of stuff. If you're down for that, please subscribe to my channel and see different kind of awesome videos I make for data science. So today's topic is all about the precision and recall. Uh, if you heard of the like classification problems in machine learning, you definitely heard of this particular terminology called the precision and recall. So what does it mean basically? Like the I think precision and recall is basically a evaluation metric through which you can identify if your model is performing good or bad. That's the basic thing to understand the precision and recall. So what does it mean? So for that, uh, I'm going to uh, give you an example of a particular problem statement and build the model and see how the precision and recall looks like for this particular problem statement. Okay. So suppose uh, just think of that. Uh, so suppose you have 10 friends okay there are 10 friends you have okay so for 10 friends uh, you are going to tell that there is uh, examination is going to come it could be any kind of exam so you, you have told to build a model for your 10 friends is that if they are going to pass in the examination or not yes or no if they pass that is one if they fail that is zero Okay, so you have uh, created different different features. You have recorded different attributes of your friends. Like, uh, what is their age? Uh, just think of that. Like, age. Okay, what is your age? Uh, uh, like, how many hours? Hours study. Okay, hours study. Um, it could be anything. Like, um, like uh, what is their IQ? If it is available, IQ okay so and uh, if they're going to pass or fail okay or fail okay so these are the different different attributes and based on that like age how many hours they study their iq based on that they are going to pass or fail so you you know their uh, history like in which exam uh, they have passed or failed suppose there is exam uh, output you already have so for suppose age 10 uh, hours 20 IQ 10 he pass 1 okay suppose he is 20 uh, yeah how many hours is like 10 okay IQ is 5 fail so in this way you will have uh, like uh, different different values based on that you are going to get 1 0 1 0 0 1 1 0 so okay so this is actually you have the data okay now based on the data you have created a model that you are going to tell that in the next upcoming exam out of your 10 friends which friends are going to pass and which friends are going to fail okay so for that i'm just uh, i'm just uh, removing uh, this okay so to demonstrate you okay uh to demonstrate that what to do so suppose uh, like uh, there is a model which you have built and this model is telling that in upcoming exam this people is going to pass okay so the peoples are like uh, okay suppose p1 p2 p3 p4 p5 P six, P seven, P eight. Okay. Suppose P nine, P ten is also there. P nine, P ten. Okay. So now you have what you happened is that like suppose you have uh, <coughs> model tell one zero. Okay. Zero one zero zero one zero one one. Okay. So these are the model outputs. So model told that this guy is going to pass and this guy is going to fail. Okay, so this is the model output which I've got. And now when the actual exam happened in the upcoming month, so what is actually happened for those guys? Okay, so suppose actual. Okay. When the actual scenario happened, when the examination happened, it happened is that like the, you see these guys this is one this is one okay this is zero 
this is 0 this is 1 okay this is also 0 this is 0 this is uh, 1 0 0 okay so 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 okay so <clears throat> how do you calculate the precision and recall so you have to see what does the got match actually so you see p1 what the total pass and actually he passed so the match is uh, the match would be match is one okay plus this is the one match zero one not match zero zero match but that match is for the zero we will not consider that one zero did not match zero one did not match zero zero did not match for zero one zero zero one one zero one zero so there is no only match so only one match has happened okay so the match is going to be around uh, one okay so this is the total number of matches so how many model told is going to pass so one two three four five so the, there are five ones over there in the model so the model told model told is going to pass is around five and actually actually how many got passed one two three four there are four passed okay so how do you going to calculate the precision and recall for this particular context so the precision would be precision precision is a match that is one out of the actual number of recommendations like five model told is going to pass so this is the precision so out of the recommendation how many actually got passed so that is the precision and the recall would be recall is going to be uh, like one the match out of the actually got passed that is four so this is the precision and recall so for this particular uh, problem statement or context you can think of the precision is out of the total recommendation how many got actually actually happening and out of the actual events that is the four people got passed out of that model told uh, like the match with the model is one so uh, out of the actual what is the match and actual the out of the recommendation how many got matched so that's the precision and recall so using this these two uh, particular uh, metric you can think of that how the model perform okay so suppose the mod the base model would be when the uh, match is very high the precision is also very high the recall is also very high so out of the five if four got matched and out of four four got matched then this is the best model i would say uh, one of the best models i would say so in this way you can think of okay so there is another uh, formula is also there for this particular context so the formula is something like precision uh, i'm just writing it over here precision is the true positive out of true positive plus false positive okay and recall <coughs> is going to be true positive by true positive plus false negative so okay so this is the two matrix also you can write in in different format so how to calculate the two positives so true positive means actually the matches so here you can see that only match is one so the true positive would be true positive is one okay and what is the false positive false positive is false positive means like the model told it is going to be zero like uh, sorry the false positive is actually did not happen zero but the model told it is going to be one so that is the false positive so here actually one uh, actually zero but model told one so this is this is the case one okay plus model told zero uh, actual one one okay one two three four one two three four uh, one okay uh, model told it is going to be zero and actually one so three so there are three so there are three false positives okay and what is the false negative false negative is so false negative is model told uh, actually happening is zero but model told is going to be one uh, 
फॉल्स नेगेटिव ओके सो एक्चुअली हैपन बट मॉडल टोल्ड इट इज गोइंग टू बी जीरो दैट्स अ फॉल्स नेगेटिव सो इन दिस केस यू कैन थिंक ऑफ द एक्चुअली दिस इज वन दिस इज वन बट मॉडल टोल्ड इज गोइंग टू बी जीरो ओके सो दिस इज द वन फॉल्स नेगेटिव वन जीरो सो वन जीरो वन जीरो वन जीरो दिस इज द वन अदर वन वन ओके वन जीरो 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 वन वन जीरो दैट इज अनदर वन वन ओके वन जीरो आई थिंक द फॉल्स पॉजिटिव वुड बी अनदर वन वो तो जीरो वन जीरो वन 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 ओके जीरो वन वन टू थ्री फोर I think the four is there. So there will be one. So it is going to be four, and this is going to be three. Okay, I'm just uh, removing that. I think this is uh, yeah. So this is going to be four, and this is going to be three. Okay. So now the uh, ah. So now just put those values in the formula. So the precision rule is. precision is true positive that is 1 by true positive 1 plus false positive false positive is 4 okay so it is going to be 1 out of 5 the same thing is coming also here and the recall is recall is 1 true positive by true positive plus false negative that is 3 okay so this is going to be the 1 by Four, so the precision is like one by five, and the recall is one by four. So these two are the uh, values. Like this is the this is the way you can also calculate. Then this is the, in this particular formula also you can calculate. So I'm just giving both the scenarios over here. So I hope you like this video. If you like it, please subscribe to my channel and see different kind of awesome videos I make for data science. If you like this sort of content also, like you can also check this particular video where I have talked about the uh, like soft max function, like how to interpret the soft soft max function in particular uh, classification problems. So I hope this is going to be helpful for you. I'll see you soon. Thank you.